You're watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks with Mike and Maria Kaiser. Because sometimes you feel like your business is being held together by duct tape and popsicle sticks. On this show, you're not going to hear the latest business fad. You're going to get useful information that you can apply to your own business right now. Hello and thanks for watching another pivotal episode of Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks. I'm Mike Kaiser, along with a woman who absolutely does not approve of this message. Maria Kaiser, how are you? I never do. And you want to raise taxes, I heard. You're against border security. I'm I actually, don't know what the voters I'm are supposed to do. I'm against schools, children, old people. Food. I'm going, food. I'm going to raise taxes, and that's my political statement for today. Okay, perfect. Yes. And now we can move on to the real part of the show. <laughs> uh, oh, and as usual, everything you need to know how to reach us, how to engage with us, how to get to our website, find all our fabulous stuff, it's right below the video in the show notes. But... I want to start with a question. Okay. So, have you ever been... so serious. I, well, this is serious. Okay. Have you ever been feeling ill? Mm -hmm. Some kind of symptoms? You look them up on the internet, and then within minutes you're pretty sure you're dying of some rare disease if that not, only hits people in Connecticut? If you're not dead already. If you're not dead already, right. <laughs> pretty soon you're dying of some rare, incurable disease. and. So where, where we're going with this today, as wonderful as the internet is for information, we find as marketers, it can be extremely difficult to find accurate, clear, concise, just answer my questions mm -hmm. information. We all have an agenda, right? Sure. So first of all, everybody has sure. their agenda, but then it's just so confusing. So in people marketing their own business, how can they help people be convinced they're not dying? Right. So help, <laughs> so help avoid that frustration for, for folks. Be clear and, and, and give an accurate answer to the information. And get, have easy access to the information. Don't make me jump through 86 hoops to get there and then I can't get it. Oh, right. God, that's so frustrating it for sure me. It sure is. Um, you know, think of... The things that people ask you in person, and how would you answer that question? Right, right, clear, right. straightforward language. Right. Um, we've seen a lot of people kind of get lost in maybe trying to be too fancy with their marketing message right. or too, uh, I don't know, trying to stand out through mm -hmm. some way with language, but missing the point of just be just being the clear answer. Just, just be clear and, and give folks the information that they're looking for and and that's how people will remember you. That's how people will appreciate you. I remember years ago a, uh, a client of ours was trying to find a pair of sneakers on the internet. Hmm. She was a runner and she said so I'd look up sneakers um, and I would find 10,000 different kinds of sneakers that were uh, approved and I would, those same sneakers that people vouched for, then a thousand people were not vouching for them. So yep. at the end of the day, I was left with where I started two hours later on the internet. Right. So try to, try to guide your customers to the best information, truthful information, straightforward information that they can walk away saying, okay, I have an answer. There you go. I don't think I have anything else to, to wrap that up with. Nothing? Not one thing. Well... I mean, you were you were so good. You just left me in in the dust with okay. this one. So no, and it's such a simple, straight to the point point. But really, just just answer the questions as you said in a truthful and a transparent way, and start there with your marketing. Right. All right. Okay. Well, good. So. I think that's it for today. And by the way, this show and the next show we do are kind of interrelated, you'll see. So we highly recommend you watch these like 400 times or so to, yeah, to get the point down. Yeah. But once again, we really, really appreciate you hanging out with us. We hope you enjoyed this video. You have been watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks, where we make your business better three minutes at a time. Ciao for now. You're watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks with Mike and Maria Kaiser.